Hey, welcome to another episode of Florida Grown and Gathered. I'm Josh Harris, and today is day number 11 of my challenge where I'm trying to go the whole month eating only what I grow or gather out in nature. And I'm out here today with my brother Buka. We've been working in the boat, pulling stone crab traps. Got a bucket full of stone crabs, but those aren't for us to eat. Those are to sell. Now we're gonna go get the cast nets and try to catch some fish and cook up a little bit of fish out here on the boat. Stay tuned. Pretty shallow, huh? You got something? Oh yeah. There you go. Nice. See nice fat little mullet. These must have been too small for rose season this year or something. Ooh, got him. Here's lunch. Freshly caught sheep's head and mullet. We're out at the island here. Got a little cook stove and a pot. We're gonna cook up these sheep's head and a mullet. Have us a little lunch. I think I might have found another good find. You got little prickly pears growing on these cactuses. I might have to get my knife and harvest some of those and peel them. Got some prickly pear. They're good. Some big old seeds in it. Some sweetness. Oh, it is looking good over here. Steaming these fish. Little Cajun season on them. They're looking good. Fish is ready, so I'm collecting a couple of nature's paper plates. Sea grapes. Perfect little food holders out here on the island to keep the sand off your food. How is it? Well, not very good. <laughs> it's <fine>. <laughs> <laughs> Looks good to me. <laughs> Got some sheep's head here. Find a little shady spot on the island under some little mangrove trees. Nice lunch break. Eating on my sea grape plate. <clears throat> it's really the first meal I've had all day. It's probably, I don't know, two, three o'clock, and we've just been pulling stone crab traps all day trying to get our line straight. So I'm ready to go home and find some better food. Today is day number 12 of my grown and gather challenge where I'm going the whole month eating only what I've grown or gathered out in nature. And I've been on the road pretty much all day driving all over the place. I'm way out in the country. I'm at a cow pasture right now, but I'm getting pallets set up um, to bring bees here this week. And this property is surrounded by just thousands and thousands of acres of orange groves. And they're getting ready to bloom here in another couple weeks. So I'm gonna be making some orange blossom honey out here. Sharing my lunch with the donkey here. There you go. You want a carrot? There you go. Oh, it's okay. Here, I'll put it right there.
You want it? Here, I'll back up a little. There you go. There's your carrot. Go get it. Back up a little more. Mmm. Yep, we're eating the same lunch today. It's the end of day 12 and I've been on the road all day. This morning I had a couple eggs for breakfast and other than that all I've had is a couple of little baby carrots driving around. So I'm home now, it's evening time, I made some dinner and I'm really excited about this. Check it out. This is a green papaya noodle pad thai with sheep's head and garden herbs. And those noodles are made from green papaya that are um, grated up real thin.